and I think I think what was interesting about this, which again people don't remember, there was no Marvel Cinematic Universe. There was no cell like, phones. No, you know, it no, was the <laughs> cell phones. There was barely cell phones. Um, so you know, when we got Smallville, it was like nobody was really paying attention to Superman. And then obviously, once the show became a hit and Marvel started, it's you know, you know, Smallville came out in fall of two thousand one, and Spider Man came out in the summer of 2002 and that was kind of the one-two punch of, oh. of you know everything was sort of taking off so when we got to this period the thing i do remember at this time is there was a script floating around that jj abrams had written that mcgee was supposed to direct and it was a superman a reboot of superman where krypton didn't blow up so the biggest art in the course <laughs> we were telling the story of you know kal-el and the planet blew up and and i remember paul levitt who, who was a actually a great supporter of the show and it was would get caught in between the politics of the speech. And he was, he yeah. was the head of DC Comics. He was the head time. of DC Comics, yeah. He would, I said, to Paul, I can't believe I'm arguing 75 years of your own mythology to you. Like, the planet blew up. So, wow. you know, it's just wow. a weird, you, you would always find yourself in these very weird situations. And you, you know, you just kind of had to take them one at a time. You know, and, and we would fight some of it. Frankly, Peter Roth would fight some of it. You know, getting Lois Lane was a, was a big deal like oh you can only have her for four and then oh you can have her for 12 and then you can have her you know what i mean but was that a, was that after we erica was cast did he extend this was this was well yeah i mean we sort of had we had cast erica and we had it but we, we, they, they only allowed us to do four that was the deal oh, that was the okay, deal okay yeah and then they said oh you could do it for 12 and then we never asked again it was just in the show yeah <laughs> right i, I guess I what you learn is that I mean, even on the, on the side as an actor, when maybe a bad analogy, but when you renegotiate, you're thinking in your mind, oh, God, this is a huge show. And so they're making so much money for the studio. And they, I'm asking for something that's going to they're going to be like, absolutely. And then you get the they 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 say and then they the give you shit. They offer you such a low number well, that you're almost like, what? Yeah, we're no, now they, in the Michael Rosenbaum business affairs podcast. Yes. Well, um, they, yeah, 